Staying at home is not a problem. We still need to make an impression when we are away from home. I think this will, is a starter, Brian. We need to win here if we want to talk about qualifying for Sydney. People will say he'll talk about Benny. I came a long way with him. I know what the type of a player, if you've got him up front there, you know what to expect from him. And you, you look at Aaron. He's now really becoming a big man in this football. If you look at the money that has been put on his head now of lately, it tells you, I mean, that is what people must know. We've got this Hariepa uh, Marumo. Let me talk about him a little short. You know, this boy came to train with us last year. He's from Velcom. I was impressed as the manager of the team and everybody. But when we got back to the next camp, we looked for him. The whole country was not there. We only found out late that he's out in Italy somewhere where he's playing. That is why I didn't hesitate to call him back. But uh, he, he's, he's going to be a, a big player in the future. Then, of course, you've got uh, a Canel Bradley, who definitely show when you've got him on the left-hand side, you, you know you've got something. You can benefit from him. So coming to our local boys, most of them, I'd say, they, they've shown a lot of character. I just try to start fresh at every camp, you know. Um, uh, I don't look to bring to bring any any ideas or any thoughts down from from the national team or take any ideas from the under 23s up. So um, yeah, it's it's um, each coach has their own setup um, and which I, we appreciate and what have you. You know, so we just got to keep going and uh, hopefully we can make Shakes happy. Is this a step down for you? Do you feel uh, at all sort of put out that uh, you've gone back to the under 23s? No, not really, because I started off here, so. I got myself as an under-23 player, although I'm now a regular senior member, but I would like to help in under-23s now and then, especially now it's for the Olympics, so I think it's for a good cause and I'm not like really going down, I'm actually going away forward, step forward, because it's towards the Olympics and it's equally as big as the World Cup, so I don't think it's like really going a step down. You have to basically listen to what the, what the coach's instructions are, but more or less when you're under park, you do, you bas it's basically what you know, and because you're playing in a striking position, the coaches are just there for guidance, but you on the field, you, you, do, your, you do the thing that's right and that's going to help benefit the team. Uh, in, in the Bundesliga, it's a, it's a very short and sharp game, you know, um, quick precise passing and what have you, you know, um, uh, short one twos, get a back cross. Um, I'm trying to, I'm trying to get involved in that sort of system here in in the in the national squads. You know, um, I just hope we can work at it a bit more, and um, hopefully I can achieve greater achievements in the national teams. You know, Simba. Not only are the girls going to go crazy for you after they see this interview, but nobody knows that this young man from Valcom is suddenly playing for Inter Milan in Italy. Yeah, it's a great opportunity to be, you know, under the spotlight of Inter. It's it feels good that uh, you know somebody is looking out for you. That everything you do is not you know in vain. Adriano Zurini knew someone from Inter who used to be his coach. So he told him about me and said that he would like this guy to, to you know to to get go and see me out there. So that's how I got I got to go. They say once you take one banana away from the bunch, the one that goes off is going to be skinned. So <laughs> that's why I want this team to play together, support one another, have that family love. If one falls down or one is not doing well, the others must pep him up. Talk to him, tell him now you'll make it. So that is what I want to see in our football, not only in this uh, uh, Amadluglu, but in our football in the country as a whole.